Labour and industry representatives have today reacted to the announcement that the Ministry of Labour is to raise both monthly and hourly minimum wages starting in January. Neither groups are satisfied with the monthly minimum wage rising to 23,100 NT, a 7.1% increase, or the hourly rate increasing 5% to $150. Part-time workers, however, say that the increase is better than nothing. But some in the public are concerned that the wage hike could trigger inflation. Hearing that the minimum hourly wage will go up by $10 NT, this young part-time employee says the hike should prove to be of some help. The wage hike was finalised yesterday in negotiations between Labor and management that lasted over nine hours, the longest in history. Starting next January, the minimum monthly wage will be raised 5 per cent from 22k NT dollars to 23,100 NT dollars. The minimum hourly wage will be bumped from 140 NT dollars to 150 NT dollars, an increase of 7.1 per cent. Come next January, nearly 2.3 million workers can expect a bigger paycheck. But many in the public say that the minimum wage decision leaves them cold. Some say they fear the hike will lead to rising prices. This round of wage increases will contribute 0.06 percent to the economic growth rate and 0.04 percent to the consumer price index, an increase that is still considered slight. Compared to the amplitude of change created in the past, this wage hike won't really cause a price fluctuation. The Premier said he could guarantee there would not be any mishaps with the rise to the minimum wage, and he urged the public not to worry.